This gym is open tonight. It, it's crowded. There's too many of us. You can't have too many. Growth is good. In fact, unrestrained growth is the philosophy of the cancer cell. We're using up resources that other cells need. Other cells? Like spleen cells? You value spleen cells over cancer cells? No, I... Other cells wouldn't have, have any value without cancer cells around to appreciate. But what about... Cancer cells are the pinnacle of evolution. We're not like other cells. We can think. We're more successful because we're smarter. You know, sometimes hey, I... Hey, the show's starting. Good e evening, ladies and gents. Especially James. <laughs> I just metastasized in from the liver. And boy, is my cytoplasm tired! <laughs> this guy. This guy is the pinnacle of evolution. Looks like you're expecting two. Oh, yes, I just love children. How many now? 537? Oh, make that 538. We're stopping at 2000 for the environment. How ecological! Well, like ZP2 says, consider having none or one, and be sure to stop at 2,000! But you don't plan, children. They just happen. <laughs> it sure seems that way! What do you mean, not reproduce? How many billion more cancer cells do we need? If smart cancer cells like us don't reproduce, then we'll only have dumb cancer cells. Things will just get worse. But the body can't handle this many of us. Of course it can. Cancer cells are just as natural as any other cells. We're part of the body. Why would the body make cells that we're bad for? It? Maybe we should metastasize out to the country. I hear the lymph nodes are nice. Not the suburbs. The country. Like where we went camping last year? Yeah. The, the left lung. lung. You need to get out more. Get out where? It's like this everywhere. Listen, listen to him. He lives in a tumor and he thinks the whole body is overpopulated. It so happens that the body's entire cancer population could fit into just one nostril. That leaves a whole other nostril free. Metastasis is our natural biological function, our manifest de destiny, if you will. It's survival of the fittest. It's a family tradition for me. My great-great-grandfather fell out living tradition. When this host is consumed, we'll find another one, or its economic equivalent. You know, sometimes I think all the cells in the body form one big organism, and that organism has a soul, and it can feel what, what we're doing to it. You and your crackpot new age theories.